Hey, what's going on out there, convicts? This is JTG of Convicted Vapes. Now, it is late Friday night, early Saturday morning right now. It's probably about, I don't even know, probably about, it's 1.11 in the morning right now. But anyway, I've been so busy with school and work <clears throat> and just training and just shit. That I um, hadn't had a chance to go back to my apartment. And I had a ton. I mean a ton of packages. But one of the packages I got had three different things in it. And the company that sent this to me is uh, Vapetio. V-A-P-T-I-O. <clears throat> they sent me one. Two. They sent me two. I guess what I'd call starter kits and one what I would call, well, what they call is a pro kit. <clears throat> we got the C flat kit. The C2 starter kit. And then we got the N1 Pro 240 watt kit. The 240 watt comes with a comes with a tank. <clears throat> These ones come with their tanks and um, I don't know. Let's open this one up. This is called the C flat kit. Smooth tech flavor optimization. Alright, sounds good. Let's take a look. print this package contains nicotine which is a highly addictive substance user manual get a uh, little caution certificate of inspection that always gives me a hard on whoa look at this fucking Gotta wiggle that fucker out of there. How the fuck do you fill her with juice? You gotta move that little plastic out of the way for your fill hole. See if I can get it in there from a 120. Let's get back on there. 
Huh. You don't say. You don't say. Dividively. How many ohms is this coil? Where's this coil vaping out here? This is a one ohm coil? Really? I guess so. Definitely. I mean, look at that. Look at how small that thing is. And you know what? I think that's actually kind of cool because you know what I hear from, from smokers about switching to vaping or trying vaping? You know, especially when most of us are walking around token on one of these. They're like, oh, it's... It's so big, or, you know, oh, it's so big. I mean, I don't know about you guys. I fucking love hearing that. But anyway, or it's too much smoke, or, yeah, whatever. But um, this is small. I mean, look at the size of this thing. And charger with a pass-through charger right there. You get a pass-through charger comes with it. Get the coil in there, another coil. This this whole piece is your drip tip. Your tank goes right there. Hell, this is a nice little fucking thing. You know... This is perfect for beginners. You know what this is perfect for? Women. Here's why. Because you ever give a woman a mod? Well, I'm going to say an older, more middle-aged woman. Have you ever given a middle-aged woman a mod? What is the first thing they do wrong? They throw it in their goddamn purse. Well, let me tell you what. This fucker right here... Go ahead, throw it. I mean, fucking look at it. It looks like a fucking thing of lipstick or eye. It looks like makeup or something. They could throw it in their fucking purse, and you're not fucking this thing up. I mean, there's nothing to fuck. There's nowhere to get in to fuck anything up. There's no fucking this thing up. And that's good for you because that's less times that you have to unfuck the mod that they broke by throwing in their purse. You know what? This just took the new title of the mom mod. This is it right here. The ultimate beginner kit right here. Yeah, I fucking like this little bastard. Okay, what is that with that one? Turn it off. One, two, three, four, five. Turn off. That part comes on top. That was a lot cooler than I thought it was going to be. It was actually like somewhat innovative, like. Plastic off. I lift my knife at work. <clears throat> All right, now we got the C2 starter kit. Vape TO, VAP TO, V A P T A O, 
define your attitude. Okay. Caution. User manual for the tank. User manual for the mod. Well, check that fucker out. It's got a nice grippy texture to it. It's got the buttons up here. This is not an 18650 or 26650. The charger right there would have passed through. Well, that sucks. I guess I can't fill it from the top. Gotta be able to throw it from the Just throw a coil in there. Prime the coil a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh. See how it's got that plastic? You just push it down on the fucking side. Let me bust out a tool here. I mean, I guess. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know how else to fill it. I guess you just gotta fucking... Put this in there and just push that plastic to the side. I don't see any other way, so fuck it. You know what? Now that I see that how they did that, I, I actually kind of, I actually kind of like that. Let's see how old these coils are. 
Okay. Well, I'll be damned. I'll be damned. This little bastard chucks. Whew, sorry. Charger would have passed through. Point two point two five ohm coil. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Not bad. God damn. Shit. I like that little <coughs> I like that little thing. Anyway, let's move on to the uh, N1 Pro 240 watt kit. Boom. Wow, all right. 240 watt. This is 200 watt with two batteries, 240 watt with three batteries. Okay. This is all just a first look. I'm just opening these up. This all has, um, they call it smooth tech flavor optimization. There goes the Frogman tank. Goes the mod user manual and the uh, certificate of inspection from Vape Tio. Get your your mod. Oh wow, that's cool! Look at this. Let me put that back on there. All right, so you want to open the battery? There's a button right there. Now, they're saying with three batteries, I don't know where you're putting the fucking third battery, but here's the tank, the Frogman. Bam. These are pre, you know, pre-made coils. You can't build your own coil in that tank. But some extra gaskets, extra glass, pass-through charger, extra coil. Oh, look at that! Check this out. There's a whole nother fucking connection. So, boom! You want to go to three battery mode? You pop off the two battery door. And you can throw on the three battery door. That's fucking pretty dope. Look at that thing. That thing is enormous. Fucking yeah, dude. Let's throw some batteries in her. We'll take some batteries out of my, uh, my double barrel. Throw, throw some batteries. Let's fucking go. Uh, let's go three battery mode, right? 
I got another battery around here somewhere. Here we go. Oops. Breaking shit. Throwing shit. Let's, let's fucking set this fucking bad boy up. Three batteries. This is like a fucking a cooler Wismac or a fucking a cooler looking below. This is pretty cool. in there. Make sure I got these in there right. Oops. Fits together nicely. Goes together easy. Now we got the Frogman tank here. Whoa. This you push down and turn. Friction fit. Ooh, I, I like that. That's a, that's pretty badass, actually. Let's prime the coil up a little bit. Oh, wow. 0.15 ohm pre-made coils. 0.15 ohm. I don't know if you guys can see that. Sorry if you can't, but look. Quad coil. That's... God damn. Let's just, you know, let's juice her up. This thing's crazy, dude. Holy shit. New atomizer. Yes. Regulated. Power. What do you want to do here? 100 watts? Hear this thing hiss. You hear that? That fucker's angry, man. crank it up. Let's go to fucking one fuck it. Let's go to 150. Oh, 150. <laughs> I'm going to go back down, break it in for a sec, and then we'll crank it all the way up. This thing is fucking goddamn solid as hell. All right, let's go back up to 150. <coughs> oh, 
Let's go up to 175. I'm trying to do it gradually. Bruh. That's max. 240. Listen to that. Woo. God damn. Whoa, fucking vape me out, dude. God damn. <clears throat> All right, back down to 200. Whoa, that 240 is no fucking joke, dude. God damn. I'm taking it back down to 100. Jesus Christ. And it gives you a battery readout for all three batteries down there on the bottom. 0.17 ohms. And look at that. This thing drinks juice like you wouldn't fucking believe. But my God, I'll tell you what. This thing is no fucking slouch. <clears throat> it's nice. Look at the design on this thing. It's fucking meat and potatoes. You can fit this thing in your fucking cup holder. You need a cup holder to drive this thing around. You gotta buckle this thing with a safety belt. This fucker's intense, dude. Jesus Christ. This shit's high speed. And that tank is, a tank is something else. Just look at the design on this tank. This tank goes together nice. You know what? In the beginning of this video, when I got this, dude, honestly, I thought this was going to be some, some bullshit. I thought this was going to be some cheap Chinese shit. But you know what? I like all three of these fucking things. All three of these devices are fucking, are fucking badass. They're fucking bad. They're fucking badass. I'm fucking impressed. Holy shit! I didn't think I'd be impressed. I didn't think I, I didn't know really what to expect. But <clears throat> I'm, I'm taking this fucker. This thing is potent. God damn it! That shit's crazy as hell. <coughs> oh, excuse me. God damn. That's... That's crazy, dude. That's crazy. Anyway, if you guys are interested in Vape T.O., you can check them out at www.vaptio.com. And um, I've never heard anything pro or con about this company. To be perfectly clear, I've never heard anything about this company. And you know what? Now that I'm talking about it, I do recall getting an email from somebody saying, hey, I've got um, devices. I, I forget exactly what the email said. You know what? I don't even know why I'm telling you because I forget what the fucking email said. Period. I forget. Forgot. But 
if you haven't heard anything about vape teal, let me be the first to tell you, this fucking thing is high speed. All the oops, there goes the tank. I caught it in my flip flop. Fuck yeah, dude. I don't know. I I have never heard anything pro or con or anything at all for that matter about vape TO. I know nothing about them. I don't know a damn thing about them. But um It says here Vivakita Co Limited. V-I-V-A-K-I-T-A-Co um, LTD, which is Six Prospect Way, Royal Oak Industrial Park, Daventry, Northamptonshire, UK. So these devices, Vape Tio, is out of the UK. And you know what? For some reason, for whatever reason, I actually think that Vape Tio has something to do with Jack Vapor. Um, I think I'm starting to slowly recall the um, email, and that may be why I don't <clears throat> remember the conversation, because um, I'm, I'm actually a big fan of Jack Vapor. I like their devices. I've had a good rapport with them for, and you know what, now that I, now that I think about it, it's actually been a couple years that I've been um, doing um, mod reviews for, for Jack Vapor, very underrated company out of the UK. And that's why every time they um, have a new product or they ask me to do some sort of review, I say absolutely send the product over. Um, and I would not keep doing the reviews um, of their comp for their company if I didn't think that they made a solid product. Their products are fucking, are, are very nice. They're well thought out. They're thoroughly designed. And they, and they fucking perform. Like, like you saw with these devices, they're all pretty cool, pretty innovative, pretty, pretty different than what you normally see out there on the market. And, um, I'm mixing up, uh, parts of yeah, those over there. They're all very, um, I don't know. I don't know what else to say about these things. They're fucking cool. It says here smooth tech flavor optimization. And if there is one takeaway from this video is that on every single I use the same juice. I know how the juice tastes. I know how it vapes. I vaped it in many different things. And you know what? The flavor out of all three of these tastes fucking great. Now, I'm not sure if they're t this is the company that's teamed up with Jack Vapor, but I, I, I really, uh, I think for some reason that they are. <coughs> like I said, this was just kind of a, uh, an on, uh, an on, not, I don't want to say an unboxing, but basically an unboxing slash first look at some of these devices. Like I said, I have never personally heard anything about Vape Tio. I don't know if you guys have. But I gotta say that I'm thoroughly impressed. Like, these are just really nice designed devices. They're not cheap pieces of shit. And, and I, for, you know, I, I, I'm very judgmental when it comes to vaping things. And I, I just had it in my head that it was going to be just some bullshit. But I gotta tell you, they proved me wrong. I mean, these are nice. Um, oof. Well, you can't change out the drip tip, but you know, just the drip tip cover, but these are fucking nice. God damn, I, I'm actually, this is pretty impressive, actually. Where'd I put the other one? They've got the, uh, the whole lineup here. First, they got the fucking, the C-flat kit for the fucking absolute beginner. 
then they got the step up for now, you know, now they've, uh, they're into vaping, you know what I mean? And then they got the big homie, the big dog, for it's like, now you're about that life. They got the whole, they got the whole, runs the whole gamut. I mean, they got something for fucking everybody here. <clears throat> this thing is crazy as hell. I mean, this thing is, is, is fucking crazy. <clears throat> this is like, I just want to fucking slip it in my mom's purse and let her find it and vape it and, and like it <clears throat> because I think she would fucking dig that. And to, to be honest, I fucking personally really like this. This is just the texture is nice. The feel is nice. The t it vapes nice. It's 0.25 ohms. <clears throat> so right here, it vapes nice. Well, there you have it, everybody. That is the lineup. Warning. Till next Self destruct time sequence activated. Three, two, one.